Oh boy. It's time to piss. Hello guys, my name is Doak and this is I Style, a series in which I paint murals based on my favorite or your favorite movies, characters, people, brands, and since today, countries as well. Yep, I was thinking that I might try this with a country and not just any country, the number one country in my YouTube analytics. And before we jump straight to the preparation, let me just say that there is a new merch. Oh, someone just bought it. And you can get it too. I will tell you more about it at the end of this video. Preparation, yeah! I have to say that I've been really nervous about this video because about 30% of you are from USA. And I don't want to piss you off that much. <laughs> so... How would a painting in USA style look like? I guess I will ask Google. Maps, flags, presidents, uh, this is not very helpful. Ah, look at this. Nine stereotypes all Americans hate. Americans are loud and obnoxious. Uh, everyone is racist. Americans only care about themselves. <laughs> Americans are stupid, uneducated people. Americans don't respect nature. Ah, this one's good. Every American owns a gun. Americans are rude. Americans are all obese, overweight and obsessed with fast food. Americans don't travel. Yeah, mad already? Let's try a typical America. What does it show? Burgers, guns, completely unnecessary huge trucks, NYC. All right, I see. Let me just say that I'm really not a big fan of stereotypes. I believe that we use them too often, but I'm also afraid that in this video, uh, I just can't go around them. So what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna ask you for suggestions. So at the end of this video, I can blame you, JFK, Uncle Sam, Eagle, Simpsons, Money, Military, Burger, Muscle Car, Liberty Statue. Rappers, guns, guns again, dollar, Trump, muscle cars again, NYC, an eagle, pickup trucks, Native Americans, Hollywood, fast foods, wheat, NFL, depression and heroin, NASCAR, a wall, <laughs> presidents, guns again, and again, rednecks. All right, thanks a lot for your input, guys. I will just repeat that this is all your fault and now, I will prepare the mural. All righty. Some of you might remember the story of this wall, how I got it. For those of you who don't remember that, there will be a link in the corner to the video about it. Anyways, I personally spent quite a lot of time in the States. I've been there three times over the past few years. For three months, I've been working there as a lifeguard. I was also traveling, painting, babysitting. And overall, I spent about five months in the US. As a European, I have to say that I truly love USA as a country. It's amazing. I really enjoyed my time over there. I have few American friends, so my feelings overall are very positive. But I also need to mention uh, that there were some things which were a little bit strange for me. One of the things that were a little bit strange for me was the fact that everybody was smiling at me all the time. I mean, it sounds nice, right? I bought groceries and the cashier was like, here is your change, sir, and you have a wonderful day. To most of you, it probably sounds completely normal, but I'm more used to something like... <clears throat> Next. At first it seemed super forced and fake to me, but right now when I'm older, I have to admit that it's a lot better when a waiter is smiling at you. It's definitely better.
Dobrý. A už robíte niečo? Áno. Tešíme sa z toho. Nepotrebujete nič? Nie, nie. Nie, nie. nejakú vodu alebo niečo? Všetko, všetko Máte mám. Všetko? Jo. That was a father of one of the guys who made painting on this wall possible. One, two, three, four. Did I mention that I hate imperial system of units? Feet, inches, pounds. Ugh. I only got slightly used to miles. But anyways, the first lines are done, so let's put some color in it, yeah. As this is an American painting, there is only one cap that I can use, the NYC Fat Cap. Ten vietor je na prd, ale není aspoň taká zima. This reminds me, why do you guys ask each other how are you? I mean, why strangers ask that between each other? Like that cashier in a grocery store. When I hear that question, I always feel like I should tell her what's going on in my life. And then it's polite to ask her how she is although I have never seen her ever I never really get used to this and by the way if this is not completely clear this guy uh, this is George Washington you see that right can't really tell if that was a positive reaction or a negative one. Although it's not even five o'clock, it's almost dark outside. So see you tomorrow. <laughs> it's Saturday and yeah, let's continue. Whoopa. I'm not sure if you can see it, but someone was speeding or whatever. na tému Ameriky. Áno, dobre, tak to, to som splnil uh, účel. Takže, no. pásce, Ďakujem. Dobi... Dobi... 
66. Can you tell what does this say? It's time for the outline. This is gonna need a lot of refinement because the shapes in this painting are pretty small and I can't achieve the thickness that I want with uh, black only. I'll need to cut these lines. Okay, I have an idea for one last detail, but this might ruin a lot. So I just hope that it's gonna work. I definitely have to make a Russian version of this. <laughs> Man, I hope that this painting won't offend you, my American friends. I love USA. I can't wait to get back there. Guys, let me know in the comments below what do you think about the painting. Also, let me know down there what should be my inspiration for the next eye style project. And before the final result, one last thing. Merch! There is new merch in my eShop dogco.com. There is also a new sticker spec. So this is the right time for you to get a Christmas present for yourself or for someone else whatever a lot of you already ordered so i hope that you are satisfied and i hope that you will be satisfied with this painting too merch in description below and this is it Thirty percent of you are from USA, and I don't want to piss, piss